Hello everyone, my name is Khaled Siddiqui and in this video I'm going to teach you how to change the main board in a DJI Mavic 2 Professional Edition. Um, so this is the drone and I want to change the main board which is the board at the bottom. The other board, there are two boards in this machine or I should say in this drone. Uh, one is the main board at the bottom, the other one is the power board which goes to the propellers and it has like a high current FETs or transistors. Okay, so let's get started. The first thing you need is a uh, star-shaped and a Phillips screwdriver. The star-shaped screwdriver has to be T6. As you can see, let me bring it closer to the camera so you can see that T6, uh, the X40 is the length, so just the T6 is important. And PH0 for the Phillips screwdriver. And we want to open these six screws first that you can see. Make sure that you take out your propellers. You cannot have your pro propellers attached when you're doing this uh, surgery. Okay. So take out all the propellers and now you're ready to work on that unit. Let's open those screws. These screws and these screws, some are different in size. So you need to make sure you put them separately so you don't mix them up. These are different. By the way, some are self-tapping screws and some are uh, regular screws. This is the regular screw. It's not self-tapping. This unit, this little piece, comes off like that. It, you have to kind of widen it and then take it off. You don't necessarily have to uh, take it off first. You can remove this, then take it off. doesn't matter. These six screws are the same. I'm going to leave those separately, the six screws. Now this whole unit should come up, pay attention carefully. This is where you need to unplug, right here. Now don't pull from the cable because you will damage the cable and under the cable is stickiness like a, which is supposed to be like stuck here but the glue has lost its stickiness because this is over two years old and use your nails to p pull this out from under the, the, the uh, socket. See this? This is the socket and what you want to do is go under the socket and pull it down. These are extremely fragile, extremely fragile and you cannot uh, push it too hard or else you will damage it permanently. Let me zoom in a little further. There, there's extremely uh, fragile. This you set aside. That's your sensor board right there. And uh, the LED light and the sensor and what have you. That's what that is. This is your main board including the radio. See the antenna cables there? Alright. Now what you need to do is you have one, two, three, four, no, not that, that one you don't have to take out. One, two, three, four and uh, four plugs to remove and one two three screws to remove okay so first we want to remove this antenna cable see that antenna cable right there you want to remove it 
let me go from this angle let me zoom in a little bit too much uh, there you go okay now we have the other antenna cable the antenna cables are rested inside these little metallic notches see those metallic notches so you have to separate them and then put, make sure you they rest again on those metallic notches you have three metallic uh, slots for them one two three now we remove these cables that's one that's two this out that's three and this one is four one two three four now we open these screws that are marked in red sometimes this one was marked red from the get-go from DJI but make sure you mark the screws with a marker so you know what goes where and also I recommend that every level that you take it apart you make a new, uh, take a picture, a snapshot of that level. This is the one I'm going to open next. Set this aside. These two are the ones that I'm open. I'm going to open now. Okay. And the board is out. See there are a lot of other screws that you don't need to open. This 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 and that now you will have to open those two if you were to uh, take out the fan uh, and uh, and just replace the board now the good news is that I bought a used unit from eBay the fan already came with it so I don't have to separate the fan so I'm gonna replace the whole thing as, as a whole unit including the fan I'm just gonna put the replacement here all right so let's let me get the replacement I apologize I had to turn off my phone anyway so this board right here which we have no business with is the board that has all the power transistors and uh, controls all the uh, propellers and if we were to change that we would have to access it from the other side but we have no business with that right now we're just replacing the main board so let me get the replacement board this is the replacement board it came in a sealed static bag this is a used unit I bought it off of eBay uh, from a person whose drone uh, crashed so they put it in a static bag and sealed it which is good even though it's used it looks new uh, I need to cut this open let's uh, do this from an angle so you can see your hands uh, this is, by the way, I should have said this in the beginning. You you have to be discharged, uh, statically grounded before you start this, because all these equipment are sensitive. Notice that little uh, washer came off. I'm going to teach you how to put that, because that's also a little tricky. Uh, notice uh, right here, there are a couple of notches. There's a notch here and a notch there. This little rubber piece has a couple of holes and these holes will go to those notches okay let me go to the center so you can see there so now this is in place the holes will go inside those notches it's very hard to see it's very very small let me go this way if I see the camera I can zoom right there is one notch 
and there is another notch and that's where they go now we're going to put this back in make sure all these cables are out of the way don't bend these too much because you, they, you're gonna break them they're exte extremely uh, uh, fragile very very fragile Now, if you were to remove the fan, let me show you something. If you were to remove the fan, this is the fan cable. So you had to unplug that too. And usually this is glued. Okay, it seems to be in place nice and ne neatly. Nice and neatly in place. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to plug in these cords, these cables first because right now this isn't seated and, and it's uh, with all the screws so it has a little bit playroom or wiggle room and once uh, you put the screws it doesn't move so the cables will have a hard time uh, being plugged in the one is in the second one is in the third one is in and the fourth one the fourth one is in. Make sure the camera's bottom camera is also plugged in. All right, so we put the cables back in their spots. This is the antenna cable. And then make sure the cables are back in their little notches. See these notches? And now it's time to put back the three screws that hold the main board together. These screws. The second one. The third one. Okay, now double check to make sure everything is in place, nothing is loose. So first you will put this one and then you put this one because this will, will screw on to this. Let me show you. This screws on to this like that. This is where the screws go. Like this. Okay, so that's why this has to go in first. This is where this cable is going to go. Alright. Make sure these little rubber pieces are in place. These are all good. Make sure you don't mess around here because this is so sensitive. These are the shock, shock absorbers for the gimbal. Now we close this and we put the screws. Again, for that we need the star-shaped screwdriver. Let's go from an angle again.
You put all the six screws. When all these six screws are in, only then you put this guy, but it goes in with, with an angle because it has to enter the little slot and then push it backwards. Sometimes on top of these screws there will be some kind of a gooey, gluey material which you need to remove. That's for protection. Okay, voila, we are all done. The unit has been uh, assembled with a new main board. And I'm gonna turn it on just to test it. Obviously, there is no propeller, so it cannot go anywhere. But we're just testing it to make sure. We want, we want to make sure the surgery was successful. So here we have a fully charged battery. And there you go. The, un the surgery was successful. And we want to make sure it shows up in the remote because it has to show up in the remote and the camera should work and everything. Otherwise the surgery wasn't successful. And there it is. It's good to go. Let me control the camera. Make sure I can go up and down. Yeah, there you go camera can go up and down so everything is good surgery was successful and this is how you replace the main board and a DJI you wondering why I removed my glasses because I had to wear stronger magnification for the screws uh, yeah so that's how you remove and replace the DJI Mavic 2 Pro mainboard. Thank you for watching. Please make sure to like and subscribe.